Stumbling block in my life Them no wants to strive One day at a time to give more blessing Even in abundance sorry ain't got nothing Still I call for me king It's more blessing Give thanks to life loot and fair present The mindset Blessed love, manners and respect Do give thanks and praise for life This is the mindset program I just saw my host And I'm here with a great honor To be here with the honorable Muta Baruka Yeah man, give thanks man, Rastafari Yes I give thanks First and foremost, I want to um, congratulate you on your lifetime but we don't get it yet. The mindset, thought provoking. You know. I'm your host, and I'm your Ida Star, and we're there with our brand new mindset series live on the YouTube. Subscribe, Ida Star Mindset Channel, YouTube. Blessed love. Blessed love, pleasant good evening, good afternoon, warm welcome to the Mindset Program. I just start, I'm your host, and I want to greet the item officially in the divine name of His Imperial Majesty, Emperor E. Selassie I, the first. Warm welcome in that beautiful and divine name. This is the Rastafari Militancy Panel Discussion and reggae artist misrepresentation of Rastafari and we have three panel with us today at least we have two right now um, we have the honorable Ja Wiseman from out of Ghana and we also have Nigel Deering that is based in Florida at present See? And um, yeah, we want to give thanks um, for our brothers them for you know taking the time out today. It's a great honor to have them on the platform here, and we want to say manners and respect to everyone who you know are tuning in. See, so what we are dealing with today, we are dealing with Rastafari militancy. See, and we. We are gonna go straight over. Um, we are not gonna, you know, hold it up too much. We, you know, been here a little while now, and um, yeah. So we just are gonna go straight in it. And the first thing we we really are gonna look on, you know, in 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 terms of Rastafari and its militancy, you know, who is a Rastafari? You know, apart from, you know, the King of Kings, Ailey Selassie, you know, who is a Rastafari, you know, and for I, Rastafari, you know, is a movement, you know, as I say, apart from His Majesty Ailey Selassie I, the first that was born in Jamaica, you know, the West Indies and you know, through the oppression that the people face through colonial colonialism, slavery, we reach at a point where we get more understanding of you know who we are because we have been taught out ourselves for years, span top of years. And we find something that was tangible, that, you know, that had meaning, seen, and it was the movement of Rastafari, the movement of Rastafari where we saw the king of Ethiopia, Haile Selassie, as God and king, seen, and we declare Haile Selassie as God and king. Zane and to I, if a man really not declare that, that Ailey Selassie is his God and King, then I wouldn't really see her as a Rasta man, you know, matter how much lax or whatever you want to have for your head. I still couldn't, you know, accept that. You would have to declare, say, boy. 
Haile Selassie I, is your God and King. So, who is Rastafari? And we are going to pass it over to the panel right now. And we are going to start off with Nigel. Blessed love, Farai. Yeah, blessed. Well, well, in terms of that question, I, I would say you, you, you are uh, on site to a level where you say that's the first thing. I have to recognize I and I King as God manifests upon this earth. Yeah, that's where the movement starts from. That's the DNA of the movement, the very, you know, the concept of the movement, that's the central concept, that's the focal point. Now, beyond that, I and I cite this thing as, as, a, as a moral force and as a, as a force for upliftment of people morally and spiritually. And so, the, so upon that level, upon that level, on an individual level, on a cultural level, this is a moral. Moral Rastafari represents the height of morality. I always say Rastafari, the beauty of Rastafari, it takes elements from, from, the, from, all, from the traditions, from the great traditions of the world, and it takes the best elements of it and, and, and put it within and have it within itself. Cause you know, it has it the, 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 the meditation, it has the idol eating, it has the fasting, you know, it has it 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 the, you know, observance of, 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 of the Sabbath. And it has, uh, it, you know, it, it has the natural liberty in tune with the oneness of nature. It, it has the, the, the upliftment of a, of, of a downpressed people, just, just that uh, ones and ones realize that. Let me, let me, let me, let me, let me take them to the fruits of the earth just like anybody else, you know, and they, they, they have a right to life. The Rastafari represents upliftment of the people, the moral, the moral and spiritual upliftment of the people. It also represents the social movement of, of the people towards, towards progress and, and um, to the, towards their own betterment. So Rastafari represents that movement. It also represents the also a movement against um, colonialism, neo-colonialism, op oppression or downpression of ones and ones, and our people internationally and universally. So Rastafari represents all that twice. So Rastafari is an opportunity for, for ones of a common overstanding together and I liberate, you know, the king uh, and, and, and such days uh, as his, his earth strong, which was just, yeah, which was uh, two, two days ago, you know. Two days ago, yeah. Um, you know, and, and, and his coronation and so forth. You know, we, so we, 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 are, we are people with a culture, a, a culture of positivity, of, of, of upliftment, of, of fighting against, a, 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 a cruel and barbaric system that downgrade the people and a preservation of, of a man's of people's integrity of their history of their of, of the, the heights of values that mankind should have we are a culture of of, of um, wisdom knowledge overstanding you know so this is rastafari to i you know it is faith it is a culture it is a movement um, it is a reality, it is a liberty, you know. So so it's not just we, we worship also but but Rastafari and all like people we go church on a Sunday or a Saturday and then them, when when them left out of it, them forget about it until you know, cause them a devil the rest of the week and then when them go to church them them holy and so forth. But Rastafari we live our we live our, our values on a daily basis cause if a man have a nuts out there and, and, and we see him not going right, a man will say, but, but that's not a rasta. See? But we don't but we don't have a look on a Christian man and say, but that's not a Christian. Because we know that's what them terms on average. So then we then, then, then they now they now uphold certain liberty on average. But Rasta, we know we have that expectation of ourselves. Eh? We have to live certain values and up and, 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 and morality. And, and they pan a height of spirituality, pan, a, pan average, and that a fluid behavior, you know, 
and to overstand in our life, you know. So we have, we have a faith, we have a liberty, we have a culture, we have the movement, you know. And so all of the all of that represents what Rastafari is, I and I, you know. Yes, I. Yes, I. Yes, um, Nigel, um, give thanks to that word sound there. Uh, we just have um, Rastakura um, join us. Zin, give thanks to your um, father, Dean, my lad. Um, great honor for you to have the here and, and, and the platform. Zin, yes, I. Yeah, I. Respect. Yes. Rastafari. Rastafari. Um, I, 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 I just ask who, who is a Rastafari, you know, just for um, Rastakura who is just um, joining us. And, you know, I, 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 I would like um, Ja Wiseman now to, you know, um, respond, respond to that still. Yes. First and foremost, I would like to use this opportunity to greet yourself my and my co-panelists on the program. I also want to greet each and everyone who is listening to us live on your YouTube yeah. channel. When we talk about the word Rastafari, it is yeah. not a term, but a name of a king who was crowned on 2nd November 1930 before 72 nations in St. George's Cathedral in Ethiopia, Addis Ababa, by Abu Na Christos, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Trinity. So Rastafari and children, are Rast children of Rastafari are people who follow the teachings of His Majesty Emperor Haile Selassie I the first, because Rastafari is his name, and he represents the personality in terms of our tradition, our culture, and our way of life. But when it comes to the topic and the discussion, which has to do with the militancy of Rastafari. Yes, sir. If you have to come to militancy of Rastafari, then first and foremost, the word militancy is an actionable word which is used to describe the attitudinal movement of the military. But the word militancy is a very combative word, very offensive and very violent word in all its character and attitude when it comes to symbolism. But socially, I underline this word, socially, the word militancy describe someone who is a protester, someone who is a demonstrator, someone who fights for the equal right and justice of all humanity. And this is where Rastafari falls under. The militancy of Rastafari is born out of the fact that Emperor Haile Selassie I is the chief and the commander of Ethiopian army and the general and the brigadier of all brigadiers because he is a field marshal. So first and foremost, our militancy manifests out of the fact that Haile Selassie was a warrior soldier, the commander in chief of Ethiopian army the brigadier and the general of all generals. And second, our attitude of militancy as children of Rastafari emanates from the attitude of resistance because of what we have denied by societal standard and societal way of life. And thirdly, our attitude of militancy 
manifest out of the fact that we love Africa and we want to protect the independence of Africa and also work towards the economic independence for the global world. So the militancy of children of Rastafari comes in a positive light in the defense of the global world for a peaceful world for one and all. Rastafari, yes, and I. When we come to misrepresentation of Rastafari by reggae musicians and reggae artists, it is something that we have to discuss passionately based on facts than emotions. Rastafari is an established tradition with a culture and a way of life that cannot be distorted by anybody. It is a metastatic order. It is a Christ-like attitude and character that people know already. But reggae music is a tool, it's a means that the children of Rastafari use to tell the world about who Rastafari is, philosophically and ideologically. Therefore, when it comes to misrepresentation of music against the children of Rastafari by musicians who carry locks and are being described as reggae artists and reggae musicians, then we have to know first and foremost that the reggae music is the music of the Rastaman. But we have reggae musicians who doubles as dancehall artists. And we know that dancehall is about entertainment and business. Therefore, when a reggae artist plays a dancehall music for business because of his talent, because man must put food on the table, we must understand them. But I, the wise man, never accept that anybody can misrepresent Rastafari because it is an established tradition and order that cannot be and can never be distorted by anybody. Because Bob Marley make it clear in one of his mus music that let's be given the teaching of his majesty when I want no devil philosophy. Because we have reggae musician who double a dancehall artist Sometimes it's very confusing when they sing, and we think that they are misrepresenting Rasta. But nobody can misrepresent Rasta because Rastafari is Emperor Haile Selassie at the first, and he has established his order, his culture, and his tradition. And everything about Rastafari is natural, original, and very orthodox in nature. But um, in, in, in terms of the movements, Joe Wiseman, I, I, I hear what you're saying as, you know, as an individual, as the king. See, no, no one can um, distort him, but as a movement, see, that's, that's, that's what we, we're looking at now, you know, when we're talking about Rastafari misrepresenting. Rastafari is a liberty. Rastafari is a liberty before a movement. So when there is distortion in the movement, the liberty will correct it naturally. So we shouldn't forget that Rasta man need to put food on the table. Rasta man need resources to pursue his way of life. And we also have to know that music is a gift and also a talent that one has to use to serve humanity and also serve himself. We must use our talent in a very positive way to create resources to take care of ourselves and the global world at large. Therefore, we shouldn't create a scenario that a Rasta man doesn't have to do business when it comes to music, right? It is our talent and our gift. And Jah has given us our talent and our gift so that we can make life and liberty out of it. But first and foremost, we must make sure that our talent and our gift impact on society positively. But nobody can misrepresent Rastafari because so, me and you are hmm. always there to correct that misrepresentation because the, 
the order has been established and people are living it. Rastafari. Um, your, your, your reaction to that, um, Nigel? Well, um, I hear, hear enough things, I agree with enough things, but I can't say I agree with everything. It is possible for, to actually misrepresent Rastafari if, if you have a one out there who proclaim himself as Rasta and we see him as the farm of Rasta. But him go out there, go on. I deal with things that is not up to our standards as they, as they establish tradition then. Not to our standards of morality and spirituality. Then that is then not representing what I and I is. I and mean, is misrepresenting it. A man well we say well then well then, him doing that for, for money and him need him need money to live. But we are in eyesight if you don't do any and anything for money. You don't compromise the principles for money. You have to, you have, to have a focus and stand on. Now, when we talk about music, it is a vehicle indeed. But when we use, use this vehicle, we have to go out and know that what we're putting out in the public is Rastafari, is Rastafari standards, is Rastafari message car. We are we are just go to the, the public just to look money to live. We are teachers, Rasta is teachers of the farm with the notion that we will uplift the people, we're going to free them and things. So we cannot debase ourselves to, the, to a level that, that, that degrade ourselves because we think that we need to do that to fit in with the crowd and make some money and get and get the 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 the, 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 the hype up. Uh, you know, response and thing. We have to stand above certain negative portrayals and misrepresentations and actually not just stand above it, but then also take our values and project it to the public and make them know the eyes with there for them. We teach them to live a better life. You know, we are, we are teaching about salvation, we are teaching for, for the man repatriation, you know, and reparation. You know, we, 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 want, we want to live better. You know, them things that they got to see grass that they talk about. We want to live in tune with nature. We want them not, not, not dealing with Babylon living and Babylon, Babylon liberty and, them, and, them, and the kind of things them that they promote and, and idealize right now within this modern world. Things like, like the man of the be himself. You understand? You know, man to be woman, woman to be man and all them. So we have to act. We, our rule right now is to put out a different message. And we, we, cannot, be, we cannot become Babylon as Rastafari artists. There's a difference between Rasta and Babylon, and we have to maintain that distance between, between us. No. Where a man has said, would say, well, it is nothing that a man can, you know, can put out as a Rast, put out a slap music and thing, and it don't come in our way. I want to put forward this analogy to a man. We have a Christian artist, a gospel artist, right? He will sing, we have put out 19 albums of 20 songs. All of the songs them is a, a, a gospel song them. Jesus Christ, praise the Lord, you know, Jesus coming again, you know, clean up yourself and all them things there. All them gospel songs. But from the 20th album, I put out 20 songs again. And 19 of the songs, they're on the same vibe. Jesus Christ, praise the Lord, amen, all, hallelujah, whatever. But, but one song out of the 20, he said, Boy, I'm a big girl, you know, he must have enough girl to deal with, and he want enough girl and thing. Regardless, I, I say, all of the 299 songs, they went put out through his career. That one song, the Christian, them all look at him and say, but what kind of man this? You understand? Because we, we, know, we know who has that. And if you go back to album number 21 and put out 20 songs and pray, be a praise the Lord, hallelujah, amen. The people, them still have it in their minds, there's something wrong with them. How come you not say nothing about that? How come you not apologize to that? Because I'm not putting them policies. 
We have to depend on this level as Rastafari, whereby we have to uphold our standards and, uh, uh, and our liberty. We, can't, we cannot allow um, a man to just come out and give the, with, with him slap music and dirty music and then we, we have to say, well, I am just make a money, you know, and, 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 and just that. Like, no, we have, we, have, we, have to, we have to say, no, no, Virgin, we hear your music before, we did a check for it, it is there on a level. But right now, you know, the pandemic levels, the war going on. See, the man can't, we can, we, and we have, to, oh, we have to hold the man responsible. Because guess what? If, as we, we say, our tradition is established, but if we allow them things to go on, and one man come out, come do that, and next man come forward, come do that, because he has to say, well, let him get through, no bad, no bad him. And next man was cited, and say, well, him, the man they get through, make a money, no, no, rast, rast on the other one. ones are copy the message sooner or later the message will go to the public say well rasta them thing a rasta deal you know you know rasta the funny slack thing to see them like the ballet thing and, and whatever they, them thing they affect the how we function the rest of we function in our society because if them get if the ballet them get the message there so them approach you them approach you on the levels that are, is a slack thing we are dealing with and it makes it harder for we to communicate the message. So that's why when we see certain things come out and the thing dirty and the thing upful, I come from man who, who claim to be I and I Rastafari, I and I have to stop it. Stand up at that very moment when them come out with certain things that don't represent our values. We, we have to stand up and be militant and say and, and draw them up and say, yo, this this can't work, this on this on a way. See, I'm, I'm not going to say, but if them don't respond and don't really deal with it, we have to put it out on the public that what them, them dealing with is not our value. You know, represents we. See, because we, 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 have, we have a message that we want to bring out to the public so in terms of I and I people and the suffering people and things. We are trying to correct hundreds of years of trauma, hundreds of years of disgrace, hundreds of years of, of suffering. Colonialism, neo-colonialism. So we depend on serious mission. We depend on serious thing there. Rastafari. Yes, yes, sir. Yeah, but I just want to point out one thing. Yeah. The elders, the ancients of the Bingy and the Boba Arda. Book right? Farai, I pray thee. Me, me, do, just just yeah. write that down. I don't want the go write this or yet. See? Yeah. Just write that, that, write that down. We are going to come I forward to I mean, I mean, I mean, we have um we have seven minutes before we go to our little um intermission oh, a little, right. yeah so we yeah. just want to bring in um rasta kura um pan pan yes, pan the vibes there yes far right yes sir blessed 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 yes yeah, man, big thanks and i hope the item you know good and great and thing sorry so we never get this start on time as schedule still but today you know you know yes sir yes, yeah but me i listen to the, the re me never hear the first presenter totally saying but me hear the comment them and thing saying and you know and i may hear the second version and thing what would i would i would i from again brother the, the bubble ghana ghana the, ghana. the, the, the second the second presenter Joe Wise, man. Huh? He's from Ghana. Okay, okay. Give thanks. Give thanks. See? Yeah, so, um, yeah, but when I look on it, after, when I examine the, the topic we, we are talking about, seeing the militancy of Rastafari, seeing, and the, the misrepresentation in reggae music, seeing, it's like, it's like, I just see that topic there. I just see that topic there, it's like you can just call out some names beside the topic. You can say, you can say, be any man, see, and if you say be any man, then it means to say people like Pantan Moja, see, and you know, the, the list goes on, see, because all of we in the whole thing and, and we are observed and, and we know the ones them who, ones that are considered say, step out of line. But as Bridget mentioned earlier about, um, Rastafari making um, reggae music, conscious reggae music, and at the same time, 
them still need to eat a food or them still have them family to feed so sometimes them end up do a different music around this up. See? Alright, then now you have a bridge, you know, just speak now, talk about talk about um, correction, making a correction to a particular artist or a particular song. See? But the thing about the correction of a song or a child to correct a song or when a man put out a song already. Only thing that really do is make the song get bigger. See? And, and if you can check it, even with, with the level with the Muta Baruka, Fantan Moja, controversy the other day, see, it just make people more want to know which song that, why, why was that song, it, it, it song become more in question, mm. see, so it's like, it's it, it, it like, you hear a song, I, 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 don't, I don't really like it, I don't really want to promote it. Right, but the, mo the moment you go put your energy towards it now and say, I don't like that song because it says so and so, see, then that song they become automatically bigger, see, because it become more of a song in question. And then with the, with this, the, the intention of the artist, see, the intention of the artist is, is to keep the conversation coming, see, and that's one of the reasons why Fantan Moja was able to say that I now apologize, see. I apologize to Muta because, you know, because he wants the song get bigger. Mm -hmm. And he wants the, the controversy to continue. Because if he immediately say, okay, I apologize, then the conversation would have done. True. Yes, 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 brother. True, true. The conversation would have done. And, and that is not his intention. His intention is for this thing to continue to be talking about. So when do after that now, see, he's going to do a song, a next song like that, which is more outrageous. Yes, mm -hmm. say. So when, when, when I observed the topic of the militancy of Rastafari, one thing what, what I come down with is that the youth, them, the people them know who is Rasta. People know who is Rasta. And nobody can trick you. You see what I say? You might can trick the people for a, 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 a look a while and thing, but the people them know who you is. They like your music, they love your music, but them know, them know Rasta. All right. Um, I remember one time I go speak at a, at, a, at, a, at, a, at a primary school, with a primary school or a basic school, kindergarten, see? And, and I asked the youth them, the question I asked the youth them, oh, what is Rasta? See? And, and, and I asked them, what is Rasta? Uh, who, uh, how them say Rasta? Who them say Rasta as? See? And, and just like all me talk it now, I saw the youth them come with it, them start to call names. And the first, the first thing they say is that me the man on the Rasta. And I said, why you say that? And him say, and him say, because he might advertise taste this party. See? And that the youth them say, you know, because he might advertise taste this party we're having beef and meat and them thing there. And as I look at you, we're 10 and below 10 year old. They have a concept of Rastafari. I say, Rastafari you know, eat meat and you promote them type of thing there. See? So, <clears throat> the militancy of Rastafari, will always stand out, see, regardless of the hypocrisy and all of the other things that were, were, other, were other individual Rasta do. Because, the, as, as, the, as the Virgin say, Rasta is a liberty, see, and, and when the liberty is being expressed, see, then you can, you can see the real from the, the fake, or you can see what is natural from what is just um, creating a buzz for now, see. So, I would say still, I would say, um, based upon how me overstand Rasta, seeing, is that, you know, everyone will not be saying the same thing at no point in time, seeing, and even with the Christian religion was established over so many years, the reason why they have so much denomination now is because people expressing them own of their different opinion, and then they get followers to support that opinion. So you have a hundred or two hundred denomination. See? I I I the same vibe with Rasta subliminally because you what know, the Christian have a book, a guide, a guidance book. See, like what you can call the Bible. See, the Rastafari movement they really have a central book like all oh, the Christian of the Bible. See? All right. So because uh, I, I pray thee, my lord. Um more your more your older point there, right there, sir. See, because we, yeah. we are gonna go for um a short break, Zane, and we, yes, we, are, we are gonna rebound. Zane, so the, the, the link, 
that they I have there I could um just just um click back the link again for okay. join back the live. See? So yes my people, um we'll be taking a short intermission and we'll be right there. Anas and manners.